The equipment is ready to begin tearing down the Tropicana. In just a matter of days, a Las Vegas icon will close its doors for good. But there is still time to soak up some of the history and the memories of what was once called the Tiffany of the Strip. And as the historic Tropicana Hotel plays out its final days, visitors are taking their last chance to see it before it closes its doors for good next week to make way for the A's baseball stadium. Fox 5's Shauna Kalafi found people making memories today as they remembered the past. We met a few different people walking around the casino floor at the Tropicana today, taking in the rich history of this hotel before it's gone for good. Now, one local teen that we spoke to is holding on to this memory in his own way and hoping to share it with future generations. Preserving decades of history through photography. Between the glass ceiling and the lavish pool, it just feels so Vegas in the epitome of the word. 17-year-old photographer Alex Gassaway brought his camera to the Tropicana Monday to capture its final days on the Las Vegas Strip. Definitely expected to see more people out here to see its final days. Right now it feels eerie, like it feels like an imitation of what it used to be. A place that should be, you know, full of life and vibrance, just kind of slowly decaying until it inevitably falls. Come April 2nd, he says he'll be sad to see the Tropicana go, and with it, a classic Las Vegas feel that's becoming harder to find on the Strip. I definitely see it pivoting more towards um, uh, luxury and consumerism rather than what Vegas is about, that, whole, that kind of fun, that old feeling, the just uniqueness of Vegas. Long after the Tropicana is gone, Alex hopes these photos will serve as a memory of what stood on this iconic corner for 67 years. Because I think it's important to preserve and archive our history so that future generations, even though it's not here, you can still look back on it. It's a form of physical memory of a place. So even though it's gone, it's not entirely gone. And Alex said he specifically wanted to capture the popular pool area at the Tropicana and also the stained glass. We talked to Bally's about that stained glass. They said they're still coming up with a plan to preserve it. Reporting from the Tropicana, Shauna Kalafi, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.